So you want to welcome back to some more Code Geese, but before I talk about this and possible spoilers, here's an artist promotion right here. So please be sure to check out Myanghima for more amazing art links to her demo link below. We also find links to this reaction video. And uh, today I only have two episodes once again. I'm still trying to recover and get better and all of that. And uh, yeah, I'm, I, I, I am being very slow lately. So I'm so sorry for that. But yes, we have two episodes. And episode six, I must say, was pretty fun. It, was, it felt a bit more lighthearted compared to the other episodes we have seen. You know, with a cat and uh, all of that. And Suzuka that is joined the school and trying to get into everything. And then Lelouch, you know, budding, budding again with him. Oh, that was pretty nice, actually. It was pretty fun to see. Then again, though, we also see the king, the emperor, the dude, the man, the, the man with the curly, weird hair. And is the major ass. The ass of major. Something like that. And it really brings up about things that... He, you know, he trying to having this uh, Aphorian state pretty much, and and you know, it's pretty much like his rules and no rules at all. Pretty much, well, you obey him or you die. And while he bringing up things like people not born equal, and that I agree on, I've, it's not the right thing, but sadly, that is how it is. I mean, uh, a child of a rich parents obviously have a completely different. Uh, things compared to those that are born poor and all of that obviously but that doesn't mean that we're trying to not make it we're trying to make it equal between people and all that but here is literally equality is wrong for some for some reason this is literally something i could see trump saying i wouldn't be actually surprised if we have done that you know i mean it is really really like going the under the skin like trying to really i mean the thing that I can see it do is that it divides people, you know? And that is always um, an Aphorian state need an enemy. And by doing what they, this emperor do is creating an enemy with the terrorists, so to speak, or the other people that is not the Britannias and all of that, you know? And then hailing them as pure blood. They are the good people. They are the better one. And that is why, they, you know, we're talking about... The, why equal is wrong, because it's wrong to compare them, the, the nice pure-blooded, with the other ones, you know? And then, of course, the pride and the hatred and racism, discrimination, all of that, like, boiling up and then, like, kaboof. Seriously, it's quite messed up when you think about it, the entire story and all of that. Not that it's a bad story, I think it's really interesting and all that, but I really see how it can apply to many parts in, in our own history and all of that. Things that have happened and things that happens and all that. And it's quite scary. And then we throw in mechs as well. And it's pretty interesting. I say, I'm really curious about it. And then we have episode 7 with... Uh, uh, we get to see Cornelia being fucking actually really, really smart. I think that is pretty cool. See how sharp she is. And how she managed to... Uh, outplay Lelouch actually. And that, is, that actually... I'm, I'm, I must say... I'm happy for that. Not that he's getting his ass kicked, but rather that showing that she has such an experience and knowledge and all that of war and warfare and all. And she managed to use that to beat out Lelouch. While Lelouch is really smart, obviously what he lacks is the experience. And of course, what we notice also the difference between loyal troops. I mean... The, the the rebels and all that, the terrorists and all that didn't really listen to him. They kind of like uh, gave up and or did ignore his order. While in Cornelia's case, they're blindly following her orders, which also makes a different case and how it works. I think that's kind of interesting, you know, very, very different views on stuff like this. But man, I'm curious about seeing more of this. And I will be back though with more Kogis next week. So thank you for watching. See you later on, and have a continuous super great day.